pour in. How are you? How's your weather today? You can unmute yourself if you want. Okay, Mahia. Or your video. Morning, morning, sir. Hello, good morning. Morning, Karen. sir. Morning, Justin. Good morning, sir. Good morning, good morning sir. Good morning, sir. And Karen, hello. Queenie, hello. Morning, morning sir. Morning, Agnes. Zeno. Kumusta ang weather ngayon sa inyo? Maulan ba or maaraw? Maaraw. Maulan po. Maulan po. Maaraw, sir. Ah, good. Sakto lang, sir. Ah, paano kayong sakto lang umaaraw tsaka umuulan? <laughs> Alright, so... Yes. Okay, so 21 na tayo. Supposed to be we are all in all 39. Anyways, this is a recorded class. So, uh, those who cannot attend, I'll just uh, maybe uh, publish this one in the canvas for them to at least have it. Now, let me share you. Let's go to directly to the, to the canvas. Let me share you my canvas in the teacher's view. It's almost the same with the student view, but of course, uh, more options are included. So this is your section and there is a possibility class that I might be replaced uh, by next week siguro class because of a certain uh, because of conflicts of schedule conflicts of schedule of other teachers kaya medyo or yeah either one or two teachers kaya medyo magsuswap kami para at least dalawa kasi yung inatandan ng isang ng dalawang teachers kaya medyo magkakaroon ng, ng changes sa schedule maybe next week pa naman yun but anyways, that's okay alright, let's go to can you see, yes, you can see my canvas already class, right? yes sir alright, so this is your navigation this is your navigation uh, menu this is your main menu I don't know what what the exact names are there I hope so that when you is this the one? yes I hope so that when you <coughs> uh, navigate or when you browse your canvas class it's better for you to just look at this one okay look at the module and this is your mode these are your modules okay actually there are five or six modules right there okay but then I did not publish yet so you can only see week 2 and then week 1 and this one the green ones okay so you can only see but you cannot see this part now if you go into announcement only announcement will view if you go into assignment discussions grades or assignment the content of your modules are this assignments, discussions, what else, files, pages, and quizzes. Now, I do not suggest you to I do not suggest you to go to quizzes or to assignments or to discussions alone. It's better for you to go to your modules and check the last one. Okay, either the last one or the ones with this one. Five points, ten points, no. If we are done with the with the uh, with the knowledge acquisition or acquiring knowledge <clears throat> part, just check this. No, October twenty five with due dates, ten points, five points. Now, if there are due dates, you can still submit that one as long as wala pa yung nakalagay na availability time. Yun yun. So pwede pa yun. Pero pag meron na nakalagay, of course you have to do that one before. No. Pero pag due date lang nakalagay, that means you can still um, you can still submit pero maglalagay kasi that there will be an indication na late submissions. Okay? Nakalagay doon. Yan. So you can still submit that one. Alright, let's proceed to your discussion. Actually, there are also here is, you know, to do things but your teacher might not be checking to-do lists for students 
<coughs> so pag dito lang kayo magre-rely, wala rin, baka may makalimutan din kayo. So it's better talaga that you check your module per module, whichever you have not finished yet or you, yes. And do it, no? Lalo ngayon second, second half class, kasi ang problema of second half is after our final exam, we'll have a uh, first one week or two weeks vacation. After that one, enrollment agad or one week pa lang. After one week, the second week is enrollment na. Don't have time anymore. Unlike your subjects in the first half, subjects in the first half, you can still uh, do it now. Yun yun, no? So make sure you missed, you do not miss some of the modules. Now, uh, let's proceed to your... Okay, so I hope you, do, you are done with this analysis. Yung PE1 is to re, uh, this is being downloaded. You can download this one. If it's not being opened or you cannot open it, it might be your internet. Okay. So I did not discuss anymore the PE1 history. It's merely a reading class, no? Just a correction. Just a correction. Dun sa PE1 history. Pero bibigay ko ng bonus sa inyo yung dalawang, yung dalawang two points na quiz. Part of the quiz. Yung green kasi is representing... Uh, Australia and Oceania yung red representing America so nagkabalik tat lang yun okay. but the general the general what do you call this one the general concept of the of those of the Olympic emblem the rings at least every country or every ring represents the five continents before and then yun seven na no and then every color you can see at least one color in a certain flag or country no yun yun so, not specifically green for australia hindi actually ganun pero it was only uh, it was only interpreted no by some authorized persons okay so yun yun <clears throat> i did not discuss any i will not discuss any more p1 history kasi uh, simply reading that one, maintindihan nyo naman na class, no? And besides, uh, may hirap din pagka... Kaya hindi ako nag-history teacher kasi ayokong dinidiscuss ng history class, may hirap din yun. Um, may hirap mag-move on when we talk about the past, just <laughs> Kaya piin na lang tayo, ha? Pero okay lang yan, kahit din yun natin discuss yan. Let's proceed to this one, elements of exercise. This is your module 2 now. It's already published, but I did not publish yet the final assessment for you to at least focus on this. Ano na muna on this? We'll focus on this. And after this discussion, I'll provide or I'll discuss this one. Okay? Uh, hmm? In case you have problems with Canvas in terms of submitting a class, no? mamaya sabihin ko na lang na-discuss muna tayo. Kasi may mga may iba na hindi pa nakaka- ano, hindi pa kabisado kung paano isasubmit yan or kung anong file type yun, yun. elements of exercise Ayan. there you go so we have three elements of exercises right? the warm up yes the warm up the workout and the cool down alright so when we say warm up, it pertains to, you know, I don't have to read this one, no. 10 to 15 minutes is okay, but more than that, no, 30 minutes, one hour, sometimes they do that one, one hour, is because of the weather, like now, no, yung 30 minutes na warm up mo, maybe hindi siya, it's not enough. So you have to increase the, the duration, right? The warm up should begin two or three minutes of light jogging to increase metabolic rate. So that means when you warm yourself up from a very light activity, papunta dun sa medyo intense warm up, but not intense warm up like a workout, no ibang workout. Ah, uh, your internet connection is unstable, my God. <clears throat> now, when you say warm up, it's like a rubber band, di ba? In the rubber band, when you stretch that one, stretch that one suddenly, it will break, no? Mapuputo siya kaagad. It's the same with your body, that you have to stretch the rubber band slowly, okay, until such time na mainitan na siya, maku-warm up na siya, and then maganda na yung kanyang uh, stretching, uh, yung function niya. 
okay? Stretchable function, ganun yun. So, it's the same with our body class na pag binigla natin yan, it will provide us unnecessary feelings na nabigla, muscle cramps, or something like muscle tearing, ganun yan. Na. So, hopefully, class, when you warm up, you have to apply the slowly uh, increase of intensity. Okay? But a, a warm up lang na. Pag sinabing warm up lang, you have to uh, perspire, of course, sweat, no? Okay? And then after that one, if you are already warmed up, your body is already warm, that's the, ti- that's the time you can have your workout. Like for example, your workout is uh, um, volleyball or basketball drills or any sports drills, you know, workout mo. So let's proceed to the workout. Oh, by the way, in warm-up, flexibility is also very important for you to warm up your joints. Okay? Para at least hindi siya mabigla na ginawa mo na lang, may maglalak ang joints or even the, what do you call this one, the chin, no? Kaya sila pakyaw, ginaganong-ganon na nila para pag nasuntok at least, no? Medyo flexible siya kote, hindi siya yung naglalak. Okay? So, when you say workout na when it pertains to the Uh, the, the drills or let's say weights training yun ang workout natin no? uh, it, it is usually 1 hour to 2 hours usually 1 hour to 2 hours yung workout na yan and cool down is uh, the part where you are going to recover for example your resting heart rate today no? if you're going to, to get our resting heart rate um, hindi naman kayo pagod last no So, pwede natin kunin yung work, resting heart rate natin. And then, after resting heart rate, let's have the wake out. After doing the wake out, we will do the cool down. Or, after the workout, just after the workout, or in the middle of your workout, you get now your working heart rate or pulse beat. Okay? Napagod ka. Yun ang working heart rate natin. Okay? And then, after that one, cool down na. Uh, The resting heart rate, the working heart rate, or target heart rate, we'll discuss that in the following discussions or following lessons. Let's proceed first to the cool down. <clears throat> Pag sinabing cool down naman, ito naman yung, kung ano yung resting heart rate mo, for example, 76 in 1 minute, 76 pulse beat ang nakuha mo in 1 minute, resting heart rate mo yun. So, in cool down, after cooling down, you have to get your pulse beat again. So, if your pulse beat, after you cool down, if your pulse beat is almost 76 or med- medyo mas mataas ng konti, that means you have already recovered so after 5 minutes or 10 minutes na cool down. Meaning, pag naka-recover ka na, after 5 or 10 minutes na cool down, naka-recover ka na kaagad, then, and that means that you are uh, healthy or fit to do or you're used to the exercises or you have a normal function of functioning of your heart and lungs. Okay? So, ganun yun. Pero pag hindi ka pa naka-recover in, in 5 to 10 minutes or let's say 20 minutes, sabi na natin, mas matagal, no? That means madali ka mapagod at mahirap na maglaylo yung katawan mo sa pagod na yon. You're not used to exercises. Ganun yun. Okay? So, good on. Let's take na our resting heart rate in 1 minute. So, 14 minutes pa tayo. Ready? So you lo- you locate your your pulse beat your pulse in your karate using your finger and your th- your your index and your middle finger here or dito sa wrist ninyo Okay normal breathing wait okay? don't forget to breathe while you are taking it Okay in 10 seconds after 10 seconds I'll start now um I'll start getting or <clears throat> I'll start the time in one minute timer one minute okay ready can you all are ready yes sir anyone who's not yes, yet sir ready? wait lang sabi yes, sir good please confirm uh. Sir, supposedly po ba nasa nasa karatid lang or nasa pulse lang nasa pulse lang yung rate? 
Hindi ko po kasi ma-feel yung nasa temporal po yung nararamdaman ko. O, oh, yun na lang. Okay lang. Uh, di, marami yan. Dito, sa ulo. Pwede dito eh. Ayan o. Oh. Ayan. Pwede dito. Sige po sir, yun na yes, lang. Kahit saan class, as long as nararamdaman nyo. Pero better kasi class, ano yan eh. Uh, almost uh, close to the heart. Okay, better if it's close to the heart. Kasi pag medyo malayo na yung, yung pulse beat nyo na nalocate nyo sa heart class, ang heart kasi is the one pumping. And then, uh, simul- no, not simul- spontaneous kasi pag nag-pump to yung heart, bag, syempre susunod din yung mga ibang part, no? Hindi sila sabay-sabay lahat. So, ganun yun. Kaya better sa very close. Alright, so ready? And start. Stop. Oh, ilan? 54. 54. Wow. 82, 82 sir. 41. 83, sir. 88. 88. Oh, okay. 71. 59, sir. 59. Wow, 59. 85. 41 po, sir. 548 sir. 53 po. Okay. Good. <clears throat> Wala na. Alright. So, 53 ang pinakamababa. 89 ang pinakamataas. That means normal pa kayo. <laughs> normal pa kayo. Pero actually, yung 40 plus, medyo mababa yata yun. Pero okay lang. If you, feel, if you feel healthy, that's okay, no? Sometimes, if you're an athlete, or you're used to exercises, uh, mas mababa yung pulse beat mo in working heart rate or resting heart rate, resting heart rate. Pero there's some na talagang sobrang nakapahinga kayo, mababa talaga. Pag mababa naman ganun, as long as, as long as you are healthy and you don't, you do not feel any short of, uh, shortness of, uh, of breath, okay lang yan. Pero pag masyadong mababa naman kasi, there might be instances na biglang mag-stop yung hininga or yung, yung pulse beat ninyo. Yun yung problema. Pero if it's okay, still okay, you feel okay. Okay na yan. Okay. Okay. Uh, wait lang, class. Ay, 92. 92 si Frenilin. Okay pa rin yan. Okay pa rin yan. Let's say from 60 or 7, 65 to 100 to 92. Pero medyo mas mataas. Medyo pagod kasi siguro kayo 92 yan. Okay. All right. Anyways, we'll we'll uh, discuss the working heart rate later. Okay. Charan. All right. So, cool down. Let's proceed to the preliminary precautions before our beginning exercises. Don't eat heavy meal in 2 hours before exercise. Or pwede na siguro yung 1 hour or 1 and a half hour, pwede na yan. As long as makapagpahinga kayo ng maayos. Pero make, to make safe 2 hours before, 1 and a half, pwede na yan. No? Attempt to keep fluid intake or yung tubig. Uh, huwag nyo atayin na, na mauhaw kayo. Okay? As much as possible, sip, sip, sip lang. No? Konting sip lang ng tubig or konting inom lang ng tubig while working. While, while working out. Ano yan. And then, be aware of your body to recognize whether all parts are smooth working order. Baka mamaya yung yung isang yung isang joint ninyo dito or dito parts medyo nag-loose na siya sige tuloy pa rin kayo nang tuloy okay that's not good right be aware of how you look after exercising for a period of time 
Okay, see if you notice any changes in how you feel and look. That's very important. So, mamaya magmukhang gurang ka na. Oh no, uh, baka mamaya, uh, you know, you feel haggard or you feel, you, you look haggard, ganun, you know. Maybe the exercise or the workout is too much for you. Okay, ganun yan. And use proper attire. What are the proper attires? Okay, ladies, gentlemen. Jogging pants. Yes, jogging pants or shorts or yeah, mini shorts. Ay, huwag naman. Huwag naman mini shorts. As long, okay lang naman. As long as ano siya, um, okay siya tingnan. Hindi naman siya yung pinaka nakikita na lahat-lahat ng kaluluwa. Ganun yun, no? Lalo sa mga babae, of course, no? When Dapat comfortable. Ano, Earl? Dapat comfortable sila. Yes, pag comfortable sila, at as long as hindi naman siya as in uh, see-through, di ba? Hindi see-through or nakikita na yung, you know what I mean, di ba? Sa mga babae naman, yung dito nyo, lalo sa harapan or sa, ano, sa lalaki, medyo, hindi ko lang, pero okay-okay pa yan. No? Not to discriminate, pero mas at least konti ang may tatago sa, sa mga lalaki. Sa mga babae, syempre sa mga lalaki na rin, no? dito na rin, pag use round color, Uh, uh, yes, round color, round neck. Para naman at least uh, maganda namang tingnan. No? Hindi yung may something na ano, ganun. O, o kayo, bahala kayo. Okay lang naman nakaganyan, masyadong mababa yung ano nyo, yung blouse or t-shirt ninyo. Basta yung bra nyo hanggang dito, pwede rin naman yun, di ba? Okay lang yun. Basta makover up siya. And any color of the jogging pants or shirt, wag lang transparent, of course. <laughs> di ba? Rubber shoes, make sure. If you can do it, uh, okay. If you can do it, uh, barefooted, walang pa, ay, wala pa, walang sapatos, okay lang, or nakachinelas, okay lang, as long as that won't affect you, baka mamaya ma-injury kayo, or it will affect your performance, or matapilok kayo. Okay, ankle sprain or knee, ganun. Sometimes kasi when you perform like, while using slippers or, yes, slippers or sandals, medyo mas mahirap kasi sa gaba siya. So, it's better na to use rubber shoes or nakapaan na lang kayo if the floor is okay, is comfortable, no? Pero pag hindi naman, better use rubber shoes. Okay? It doesn't mean naman na okay lang naman kahit nakapambahay nga kayo as long as Uh, yung pambahay nyo is sports attire siya or proper attire siya. Hindi yung nakapantalon or maong pants, ganun. Tapos nag-exercise kayo. Huwag naman, glass. Now, okay, so yun yan. Do not suddenly increase your exercise rate. Oh, yan yung sinasabi ko. Do not suddenly increase. no Huwag biglaan. Pag may sakit ka, huwag muna. Okay? But sometimes, there are those na medyo masakit ang katawan, ini-exercise nila, win-workout nila, nawawala. That's true, class. No? At some cases, not all. Okay. Pero pag may lagnat ka, tapos magpa-practice ka or mag-workout ka, yun ang hindi pwede. Lalala yon Or minsan pag konting ano lang, konting sipon or lagnat na kaya mo naman, yung mga iba ginagawa nila, they, they work out, they, they exercise. Tapos nawawala naman. And I have experienced that one. No? But if you feel like you can't, or if you don't want to do it, ayaw mong sumugal, then do not do it, class. Okay? Breathe slowly and deeply as you stretch. Okay? And don't forget to just breathe, breathe, breathe. Try to fill the air to your lungs or in your heart. Hindi lang yung breathe, breathe, breathe. Stomach out, stomach in, breathe, breathe in, stomach out. Breathe out, stomach in. Yun, yun, no? Or so, breathe in, fill the heart, the air in your heart and your lungs, not just in your stomach, class. No? So that's very important. Avoid stretching the ligaments, yung mga joints. Ni-stretch nyo, na-overstretch nyo na na overstretch nyo na gano'n, no? Until, until nag, ano siya, nag overextend or overflex siya. Mahirap din yun. Mag, pwedeng mag, mag, mag uh, slip yung mga joints, lalo na sa kneecap class, no? Yan. And then, what else? Stretching from a seated position rather than standing position takes stress off the lower back and decreases the chance of back injury. So, sometimes better to stretch while, while sitting down. Pero, Our stretchings are more on 
uh, or cool down and uh, just warm up or more on from standing to sitting position not just standing not just sitting position so alternate ganun ginagawa natin ginagawa namin no so stretch at your own pace yung seven pa doon paying attention to what you are doing okay or exercising or working out at your own pace we have individual differences that means we have individual level of fitness hindi tayo pare-pareho so Maybe light exercise to moderate exercise, pwedeng sabay-sabay yun lahat. Pero, there's some na hindi kaya yung pagka-intense, na hindi kaya yung ganito. Kailangan nila magsimula. They have to start at the <coughs> slow pace or <coughs> at the light pace, light, light manner before going into the heaviest or more intense one. Ganun yun. Okay? So, there you go. So, those are the three elements. Yun na lang muna yung discuss ko ngayon. Uh, kasi those... This, these are um, in part of your module one na muna. The rest, next meeting na lang. Now, so we are now in module two. I'll publish now module uh, two, M2 assessment. This is warm up, stretching and cool down exercises na muna. Activities na muna, wala na muna ng uh, workout. Kasi yung workout ninyo nandito sa iba na. So yung mga proceeding modules ninyo class, you're going to do the workout but of course don't forget to warm yourself up first before performing all the modules ganun yan no the more class will not have a will not have synchronous synchronous activities or physical activities like for example i am here standing in front of you uh, you're doing your we're going to have our exercise pero actually pwede yon no pwede yon para at least ma makita natin but the problem is delay kasi yung sometimes yung video ng iba. So, mahirapan ako mag-monitor ganun yun. No? Delay. Tsaka baka mamaya, it might affect the internet. Okay, so, mas maganda ganito ang gawin natin. Asynchronous or yes, asyn not synchronous yung performance ninyo. All I have to do is watch it. Okay, if you're done submitting it. Now, if I open this one. There you go. This is... Okay. Uploaded also in YouTube. This is embedded in your in your canvas. So this is the warm-up. All of the PE teachers are here. This is the stretching and this is the cool down. Oh, ito ako nandito ako. Ayan. Si kaming charge ng cool down. Si Sir Felix and si Ma'am Kathleen. Ayan. Ayan. Yung mga iba dito naman sa amin. Ayan. Mga pasaway na. Alright, so you're going to submit that one through website URL or media recording lang. Okay? So pag media recording, ito lang yung kiklik ninyo. Pag website URL kasi, that means you have submitted your, your, you have uploaded your video in your YouTube channel or in your OneDrive pagka uc-bcf.edu itong Outlook email ang gamit natin you have a OneDrive online no? you can submit that one in your OneDrive or if you are using Gmail naman you can submit that one in your Google Drive naman and then you just submit the URL the link of your Google Drive file or OneDrive in your in this canvas ganun yung website URL but you have to make sure hanapin nyo doon you have to make sure that uh accessible or make an access to those who have links okay so that when i click the link i don't have to message you na please give me an access para mapanood ko no need for that one okay or you can upload it also in your facebook if you want but and then submit the link of your facebook video to the canvas dito sa canvas no the problem is pag hindi tayo friends i cannot view that one so if you want to to sub upload it in your Facebook class, make sure na i-public niyo yan. Para ma-view ko. Pero syempre, ma-view ng lahat. Unlike in OneDrive or in Google Drive, it's only you and the one you have sent uh, you have sent the uh, you have sent the link. Okay? Pero make sure na access yung access, i-click niyo yun please, no? Para hindi na ako nagme-message sa inyo na give me an access or access request ganun. <coughs> okay? If that's the case, website URL, no? Pero pag media recording lang, diretso na that will be uploaded to the canvas. Okay? How many? Unlimited actually, no? As long as in every, in every, uh, 
in every submission, it's less than 500 or 300 MB okay, in every submission. So you can stop, you can resubmit, resubmit, resubmit. It will not be replaced by uh, other videos. All right. So any questions, class? Questions? This three videos. Uh, wait, lang pala. This three videos class. You can submit it three separately or all of it one, all in one na lang. Pwede yon, no? Or tigisan na muna, pwede na na. Separate para at least mas mabilis mag-upload. Okay. What else? Oh, yun na. Questions? Class? None for sir. The others? Answer. 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 Okay. So, kung wala rin naman, I'll stop sharing. And... Would you mind showing yourself? No problem. Pure. Pure ha kayong nga nakadigos, di kayo nakahilamos. Hindi pa kayo nag-toothbrush. Oh, ang baho nga, no? Naamoy ko. <laughs> ako, hindi pa ako nalilip. <laughs> Kahit nasa kama pa kayo, nakahiga kayo, okay lang yun, class. No problem with me. Okay, as long as your presence is really there. Ay, ang gaganda tanggo ko po naman pala ng mga sadyan. Okay. Ayan. Hello. Hi, hi, hi. Ayan, screenshot tayo, ha? Mag-smile lang kayo. Walang simangot. Ayoko na nakasimangot. Unless may malaki kayong problema. Pwede nyo ako lapitan, wag lang tungkol sa pera. Ready, screenshot, and... Oy! Frenilin! Sana si Frenilin? Ayan, and one. Okay, page two. Isa pa. And page one again. Isa pa. And last, page two. Smile. Yan. Uh, attendance, and at the same time... My documentation to be reported to the school that we are having our class, di ba? Ganun yan. Okay, so if you don't have any more questions, class, you don't have any more questions, <clears throat> or for now, wala kayong questions, you just personally message me, or in the group chat, if it's, if it concerns, for, if the concern is for everyone, everyone, but if not, pwede namang personally message me, no? Uh, makikita ko naman sa message request yun. Yun lang naman. And today's Thursday, right? Oh, Thursday. So, magagawa niyo yun, module 2. Until Tuesday siguro, no? Until Tuesday. I might be just discussing Tuesday or not discussing Tuesday. Baka dun nyo i-gawin yan, no? Hanggang Tuesday. Para Thursday, ay, ay Friday pa lang kayo, no? Para Friday, Simon. Alam ko, tinitest ko lang kayo. <laughs> Joke lang. Well, thank you for reminding me. <laughs> Friday pa lang ngayon. No? Um, so, Tuesday, pwedeng yan pa rin yung activity nyo or pwedeng bago na. No? That depends. Kung hindi na tayo siguro mag-zoom muna sa Tuesday, so Friday na siguro. Or maybe Tuesday, pwede rin naman. Pag nakita kong tapos nyo na lahat yan and you have submitted already. And then, of course, the quiz in Module 1. Okay na tayo doon. Right? Tuesday, baka... Mamaya, iba na yung teacher ninyo. You just, ano, class, no? Uh, just be guided. Tingnan nyo yung canvas ninyo. Baka si sir, ano na, ganyan na, no? O, kaya ngayon, sinasabi ko na para hindi kayo mabigla. Baka biglang, ay, ba't iba na? Ganyan nyo, no? Kasi sa schedule na yun. Either ako pa rin or mag-iba na, class, no? Anyways, okay lang yan. Makikita rin nyo naman kami lahat sa mga videos. O, yan, yan. So, if you don't have any more questions, class, you may now start or taking the quiz if you're not done yet in module 1 and start with your uh, module 2 pagka okay na tayo. Right? So, I'll be ending this one now. Thank you so much for attending and listening. Hopefully, the others can attend also. Goodbye, class! Yes, sir. Bye, sir. Goodbye, sir. Bye, sir. Thank you, sir. Bye, sir. Thank you, sir. Bye, 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 sir. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Yes, thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Nathaniel. Earl, thank you. Yes, you're welcome. Everyone, you're welcome. Yes, Agnes. Bye. Thank you, sir. Yes, you're welcome. Thank you, sir. Thank you, thank you. Oh, I'll be ending this one. Say goodbye, Ria.
I'll be ending this one in 5, 4, 3, 2, and end.